And welcome back to the Hilltop with a very happy Molly. Are you happy right now, Molly? I'm happy. You're, I you am. Won I'm seven, exhausted. I'm happy. You're exhausted, but you're happy. You won 76-73 in double overtime this afternoon. And I feel a little bad for our audience. I told them before the game we'd see you again on Thursday, but you're seeing Molly again here on Saturday. What was the key to victory this afternoon? Uh, first of all, it was a great game. Um, you know, that I thought our kids – got down got up got down got up but i thought they were really really resilient um in those two overtime periods um had an opportunity to win in the in the first overtime give up a four point lead in the last minute um get down by four points in the second overtime we fought back um they just kept fighting back fighting back we didn't shoot the ball well um, we had trouble defensively you know number number 20 uh Devashray is a fantastic player she's a really difficult matchup for us their posts inside present problems but I'm just really happy with how tough our kids were today and how resilient they were, and I'm really, really happy for them that they got a win. We were in this position before with Pepperdine and came out on the losing end of it, and I'm just really happy we could play this overtime game to a win. You know, I know one of the things a lot of teams shoot for is consistency, but this is the first time this year you've won three in a row. How big of a step is that for this year's club? Well, I'm certain that you just jinxed us, so thank you, George Devine. Um, yeah, I, I'm good at we, that. Uh, you know, we don't really think about how many games we've won in a row or lost in a row. Um, we are not a team that can afford to look much further than the day that we're on. So, um, you know, now we need to rest a little bit. We need to get prepared for a very tough St. Mary's matchup. They present real problems for us with their physicality and their post play. Um, we got off to a really poor start the first time we played them. So, um, But this, I'm just really happy for our players today. We're going to enjoy this for today and for tomorrow and then come back ready to work next week. But really proud of all, all three of those seniors for stepping up and making sure we got it done. Yeah, especially when you were down nine late in the third quarter. What a big mm -hmm. turnaround there. And you took the lead early in the fourth. Yeah, no, there, it was a great game. I mean, it was back and forth. They did really good things at times. We did good things at times. Um, but, uh, you know, we, we knew we'd have to get some consecutive stops against them um, just because, you know, Devash Ray is such a matchup problem. And she's the kind of player that in the fourth quarter in the overtime, she's the one that wants the ball in her hand. She made that huge three-pointer um, to, to tie the game up. Um, and we gave, you know, they had an opportunity there, two opportunities uh to make shots at the end of the game too, but she's the kind of player that can put a team on her back. Um, Kaylin and it was Kaylin did a good job on her, and then the team really stepped up. I thought Mishka and Moa got big rebounds at the end. Um, everybody played and contributed really well. Uh, just very happy for them. Well, Molly, I know a lot of Don's fans are very happy. Tough victory, and I think they can hear the exhaustion and the delight in your voice. Yeah, no, I, at some point there was just not much left to give them. They were either going to figure out a way to get it done or a way to not get it done, and fortunately they got it done today. Well, congratulations. Thanks okay. for joining us on the Happy Recap. Right. Thank you, George. That's Molly Gutenbauer. We'll have more after this. Amy Tulio will return to the booth on the Hilltop right here on the W.